So, let us find out the value of cot P A also. We know that cot of A plus B is equal to cot A cot B minus 1 by cot B plus cot A. Now, put B is equal to A. So, cot of A plus A equal to cot A into cot A minus 1 by cot A plus cot A. Now, this is cot to A is equal to cot square A minus 1 by 2 cot A. Okay, now, let us write the value of sin to A in terms of tan A. So, that means, let us consider sin to A. Sin to A is equal to, we know that 2 sin A cos A. For our convenience, we can write this one as a 2 sin A cos A by 1. Replace this one by one of the trigonometric identities that is cos square A plus sin square A. So, 2 sin A cos A by cos square A plus sin square A. Now, divide both numerator and denominator by cos square a. So, that means 2 sin a cos a by cos square a and divided by cos square a plus sin square a divided by cos square a. See here cos a cos a gets cancelled. We get sin a by cos a is tan a. 2 tan A by cos square A by cos square A is 1 plus sin square by cos square A is tan square A. See very interesting the value of sin to A is equal to 2 tan A by 1 plus tan square A. Once again, let me repeat once again, the value of sin to A in terms of tan A is 2 tan A by 1 plus tan square A. So, let us find out the value of cos to A in terms of tan A. Okay. Let us consider cos to A cos 2 a is equal to we know that cos square a minus sin square a. So, for our convenience this can be written cos square a minus sin square a by 1. Again the 1 can be replaced by the one of the trigonometric identities that is cos square a plus sin square a. So, cos square A minus sin square A by cos square A plus sin square A. Divide both numerator and denominator by cos square A. So, cos square A minus sin square A by cos square A. Cos square A plus sin square A by cos square a. So, this is 1 minus tan square a by 1 plus tan square a. So, cos 2 a is equal to 1 minus tan square a by 1 plus tan square a.
So, let us find out the value of sin 3 a in terms of sin a. So, let us find out. So, let us consider sin 3 a. So, this sin 3 a we can write sin of 2 a plus a. This is in the form of sin of a plus b. So, let us expand it sin 2 a cos a plus cos 2 a and sin a. Now, let us write the values of this sin 2 a and cos 2 a. Sin 2 a is nothing but 2 sin a cos a only, but whereas cos 2 a we have to write in terms of sin that is 1 minus 2 sin square a. So, sin 2 a is equal to 2 sin a cos a into cos a plus 1 minus 2 sin square a of sin a. So, now this is 2 sin a cos a into cos a this we have to multiply these two cos square a plus sin a minus 2 sin square a into sin a is sin cube a. Now, again we have to change cos square a this cos square a we have to change in terms of sin. So, 2 sin a into 1 minus sin square a. So, plus sin a minus 2 sin cube a right. This is 2 sin a minus 2 sin cube a plus sin a minus 2 sin cube a. Now, these we have to add these two and we have to add, but we have to put the negative sign. So, this is equal to we get 2 sin a plus sin a 3 sin a minus 2 sin cube a 2 sin cube a we get 4 sin cube a, but minus that means sin 3 a equals to 3 sin a minus 4 sin cube a sin 3 a is equal to 3 sin a minus 4 sin cube a. Now, let us find out the value of cos 3 a in terms of cos a. So, let us consider cos 3 a. Again this cos 3 a we can write cos of 2 a plus a. So, cos of a plus b formula cos a cos 2 a cos a minus sin 2 a again sin a. Here we have to change this cos 2 a value and sin 2 a these two values we have to replace this time cos 2 a in terms of cos square a we have to write 2 cos square a minus 1 into cos a minus 2 sin a cos a into sin a. Now, this is 2 cos cube a minus cos a right minus 2 sin square a and cos a. Again this sin square a in terms of cos we have to write. So, this becomes 2 cos cube a minus cos a this is 2 cos a minus 2 cos a into 1 minus cos square a. 
So, this can be written 2 cos q b a minus cos a minus 2 cos a plus 2 cos q b a. So, these to be added and these to be simplified. So, this becomes 4 cos q b a minus 3 cos a. So, cos 3 a is equal to 4 cos q b a minus 3 cos a. So, this is the formulation of cos 3 a. 